We didn't bring our culture with us. We, it was it was uh, taken from us, you know. And we had to, and that's why it's really interesting to see these really amazing ways we had to reinvent our, ourselves, you know. And I think that people love the comics. Uh, uh, black people love the comics medium so much because it's so immediate. Because if you have a pencil and you have a piece of paper, you can make a comic. You can make something about who you are. Stereotypes are always going to exist, you know. But when they become the norm, when they become like the only way that they express a certain uh, group of people. That's when it becomes problematic. That's when that's when it's un, that's when it becomes unbalanced. They don't see us as being complex, you know. And you know, you can see like comics people as being complex because all the different stories and stuff. But because our representations, I think, are so canned and so uh, uh, caged up, you know, they don't see that we can express ourselves that way. They don't see that we. And also, you know, comics have a, have a way of, of making you anonymous anyway. You know, they, they, you know, anyone can do them, and so it's like you can have like a, a vast history of people doing it. And we do have a vast history of, of, of African Americans doing comics in this in this country. George Harriman, you know, East Sims Campbell, Jackie Orms, people like that who are pioneers that people don't even know about because they just assume that we are not that we don't create that way. Just the amazing amount of people like historically that's been doing it, and the culture of the people. Like when I discovered Ekbach and you know what was happening, or discovered like this all these. Um, these pioneers. I didn't know about Rob Stowe's show that did uh, down in Atlanta, for instance. Uh, I mean, I was coming down in Georgia. Uh, I think it was at the Tubman Museum, right? I mean, stuff like that. I was like, I had no idea that people were out there pioneering these particular, these particular things. And so, Black Comics, this book that Mark Batty, publisher, by the way, is, is publishing out of New York, um, is an opportunity to not only share our own history with ourselves, but like just with the world, you know? And um, just to show, like, wow, this is a complex uh, um, culture that black people are very expressive and we can be whatever we want to be, you know, and if you're, if you're a black kid coming up in the hood or in the country or whatever, I'm from the country, you can be, um, you can do this, you know, and I think that's one thing that's what I'm excited about is like, man, there are, our expressions are so diverse, you know, and that's what I mean, I'm really happy about, that we get to share just the, just the energy that people are doing out there, you know, that are, that are expressing themselves. Like,